then the villagers take matters into their own hands by constructing a road by themselves. Villagers in Venda, South Africa, have demonstrated extraordinary community endurance and resourcefulness by pulling their resources to build a badly needed road using only money from individual donations. Communities have grown more unhappy with the slow pace of infrastructure development and this grassroots effort is a clear manifestation of their discontent with the ANC government and a sad representation of the difficulties they face. Inadequate infrastructure, especially the state of local roads, has been a problem for vendor people for a long time. Travel, getting to and from work and the growth of the local economy are all severely hampered by the lake of dependable roadways. Residents of Venda have been growing more frustrated as they wait for the ANC-led government to deliver on its promise of improved infrastructure and public services. The villagers' patience had run out, so they resolved to solve the problem on their own. Residents who were tired of seeing their road ignored finally took matters into their own hands and started a crowd funding campaign to raise money for the road's development. They solicited or solicited donations from locals and amassed enough cash to pay for all of the required resources. Their unwavering dedication to bettering their own living situation is reflected in this group and of all. Skilled locals gave their time and leadership to oversee the building process. Every time or everything from clearing the land to building the roads foundation was a group effort that brought people of all ages and walks of life together in the sake of a common goal. The road was built with money raised and materials donated by the villagers themselves, reflecting a growing feeling in South Africa's rural areas. Many citizens feel the ANC administration has failed to deliver on its promises to better their quality of life and access to basic necessities. Some communities have had to rely on their own efforts and resources because of the persistent problem of an in of inadequate infrastructure. This bottom-up strategy shows admirable uh, initiative and a desire to make change. But it also calls into question the government's duty to provide for its citizens' most fundamental requirement. The effort is a powerful reminder of the uh, resize or resi resiliency and the tenacity present in South African communities as the villagers of Venda continue to work on the road. Their deeds may be a reaction to government uh, ineptitude, uh, but they also serve as an example of the resilience of communities and the ingenuity of their average members. This case study from Venda highlights the growing sentiments among citizens. Therefore, the ANC's government's reaction to similar grassroots movement will be keenly studied. The people of Venda have 
made it obvious that they are no longer content to sit back and wait for things to improve. Rather, they are ready to take matters into their own hands and use their own resources and drive to make things better. They are hoping that by taking this move, more people will start thinking about the government's role in the lives of its citizens. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Dr. Jones. Bye for now. Please subscribe.